Hello all, JT here. We have an exciting feature in our latest software release which will allow you to custom name addresses. This way, instead of a regular address appearing on the screen of your lattice, you can now have custom names for them. Every Ethereum address, even the one on your lattice one, can have its own label. Contracts, tokens, routers, you name it. If it's an Ethereum address, you can create custom tags for accounts that you typically use to make them easily identifiable on the Lattice One. First off, we have already paired the Lattice One with the Lattice Manager and MetaMask. If you haven't done this yet, please check the Knowledge Base or our YouTube channel for these necessary steps before starting the rest of this process. It's time to get our transactions out of the Dark Ages. Today's demonstration is going to be an example transaction on Uniswap. So the first thing we need to do is install the ABI pack. Then we will show you how to make custom address labels. Neat. Let's get started. Let's go to lattice.gridplus.io, log in to do the first part and add the ABI pack for Uniswap. On the left menu, click Contracts, then scroll down to the ABI pack you'd like to install. Then click Yes on the Lattice One to proceed with the installation. Then click Continue. Now, in order to add custom address labels for something like Wrapped Ether or Uniswap, we need to find the router address. One way to do this is to search on Google, then verify and copy from Etherscan. Copy the address and then give it a description. Today we will be making custom address labels for Uniswap, Wrapped Ether, USDC, and our Grid Plus demo wallet. Approve the associations and we'll be able to see the custom address labels on the Lattice One. Continue this process for the USDC label or for any other address you would like a custom label for. Let's do a transaction from we to USDC to see what these addresses and ABI packs look like on the lattice. Set your values, click swap, confirm swap, and then confirm on MetaMask, and then finally sign on the lattice one. Let's take a look at this transaction three different ways. The first, without custom address labels or ABI packs installed. In our second view, we have the Uniswap ABI pack installed, but still no custom address label. And finally, in our third view, we have the ABI pack installed along with custom address labels. As we can easily see now, this is a Uniswap V3 transaction. We are executing a swap of wrapped ether for USDC and we are sending the result to the account we use for demos. Now this is human readable data. Now you can head back to Etherscan and check the transaction on the blockchain. We hope you've enjoyed this tutorial today. On behalf of the Grid Plus team, my name is JT. Cheers and big hugs from Kansas City.